Hello to you guys, Crystal here. Welcome back to Retro. I hope you're all having an absolutely amazing, amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on what time of day it is for you. Uh, currently, it's a little bit before, well, actually, I guess it's a little bit after 11. How about we leave it at that? <laughs> um, let's, oh, here we go. So I have been sending the want to trade fruit letters. I think we may have gotten our replies. Let's see. I, I'm not saying this works every time. It definitely doesn't. But, you know, if I get some fruit out of it. Crystal, it's always good to get loot in the mail. I had no idea that you'd send something like that. I want to return the favor. I can't stay mad at you. You were mad at me? <laughs> okay, Kurt. What did you send me? Yeah, <laughs> we got an orange. All right. So again, our native fruit is peaches, so pretty much anything other than peaches is good. Crystal, getting a letter? That's nice, but a present too. The only way to thank you for such a nice gift is by sending you one in return. I hope you like it from Aurora. All right, Aurora. What do we got? Okay, we got a shirt. I got a kappa suit. <laughs> Alrighty. It's all right. We got one fruit. Honestly, if none of the others have fruit in them, it's fine. Uh, dear Crystal, I was so happy to get your letter and that present. I also tried to select a gift that's just perfect for you. No need to give me a gift from Queenie. I swear, if it's like a toilet or something. <gasps> no, it's a pear! Yay! <laughs> okay, awesome. Clyde, my man. To Crystal, yippee! I got a present. I seriously love presents. I have a special present I want to give to you, too. I hope you like it. All right, Clyde. What do we got? I got, <laughs> I got another orange. That's okay. That's totally fine. Oh god, Moose. <laughs> Yo, Crystal, it was freaky you sending that present out of the blue. Here's something to say thanks. It's perfect for you. You better use it. All right, so from Moose, we got... <gasps> we got an apple! Oh, Moose came through! Moose came through. I'm very happy with this so far. This has been a good haul. Alright, Monty. Crystal, thanks for the great gift. The letter was good too. You sent me something that I didn't deserve, so this is my way of saying thanks. This is weird. <laughs> Alright, what is it? What is it? Oh, oh. I got another shirt. I got a funky dot shirt. Awesome. Uh, thanks for the lovely gift. Please accept this gift. I really hope you like it. No need to give me a gift from Allie. Oops. Wrong one. We got... I got another pear! <laughs> Yay! Okay. Good. More fruit, the better. Hey, Crystal. Like, hello! Thank you so much for the gift! Thank you for making me so happy. I got a present for you. You're gonna be surprised. From Mary... See. Oh, oh my god. Is that all of them? Uh I could be mistaken, but I think that's all of them, including the peaches that we already have. So now the only fruit we're missing is coconuts. Oh, ABD notice. Dear Crystal, we're pleased to present you with your shopping card. Use this card to access your savings account at select retailers. Oh cool. I forgot about that. Uh, remove present. Oh, there it is! Alright, so we can check that out later. Uh, something else for Mary. Hey, Crystal, your present made me all totally happy. This is, like, spooky weird, but I have a present for you, too. Think of me and stuff. Um, why did she send me two? I got a leaf shirt! Heck yeah! I'll take it! Alright, so that was a really, really good round of letters. Now here's the fun part. Um, I feel like, you know, with the newer Animal Crossing games, it's pretty straightforward where you can plant trees. In the older games, it gets a little funky. It's just, they're not very clear where you can do it and where you can't, in my opinion. Um, so, I might not plant these right away. I think what I might do, if I remember correctly, if I chop down a tree, say for example this one, and I immediately plant one of the fruit in its place, a tree will grow. 
Pretty much. It's like guaranteed, I think, from what I remember reading. Um, <laughs> Kurt's like you want in. <laughs> uh, if they have an axe today, perfect. If they don't, it's fine. I haven't seen one yet. They don't. Um, oh, a moment, Chris. I must tell you that we'll unfortunately be closed on February 9th. Sorry for the sudden closure, but we need to do some remodeling. Yay. Thanks much for understanding. Oh, I'm excited for you, buddy. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna buy these roses. I'm kind of tempted to buy this and give it. We have a couple different villagers in town, Clyde being one of them, and I think Samson being the other who have fruit furniture. But I might also buy it for me, <laughs> for a fantasy room. We'll see. Maybe I'll keep it for now. Oh, I can't. Oh, right. My pockets are full. Uh, fruit doesn't rot or anything in this game, right? I don't think it does. I think it's just like turnips that probably would. Um, I don't have any storage in my house, so I might just have some fruit lying around. Although, you know what? What I might do... Uh, I'm gonna plant the duplicates. So we got an extra pear and an extra orange. I'm just gonna go find a place for these. And I think I actually already know where I'm gonna put them. <laughs> oh, wait. Uh, oh, I'll come back for that later. I didn't have the chance to record yesterday. I see that one too. Um, but I did sign on to water flowers and such. And uh, this first snowman we made was so teeny. It was so cute. Okay. So I kind of want to get these dirt patches filled in. And I think you can do it with trees. So we're gonna bury a pear there. And just in the interest of not having everything all in the same spot. Um, let me think of a good place. I kind of want to plant one here, but I don't know if it'll let me. You know what? For science, right? I think it'd be a cute place. But yeah, uh, let me go see if I can't find that other snowman we built the other day um, by Town Hall. It might, uh, it might be really, really teeny. <laughs> yeah, there. Look at how cute that is. <laughs> it's a shame, though. Here I am with my decidedly better than average looks. Want folks far and wide to check out my big debut, you know, stroll around, shake hands, kiss babies. But as you can see, I've got no legs. Just have to be content with quietly smiling at passers-by. <laughs> kind of sad, really. I I think I'm so used to, I think it was New Leaf, where they like slowly melt down and like become a little bit more like deformed each day. These guys just, they just literally shrink. <laughs> I think that's great. Um, alrighty, so let's go put away our fruit haul. I am so happy right now. Um, when I played this on stream, people gave me that same suggestion, you know, send letters with fruit to get different kinds of fruit back. And it kind of worked, but my villagers were very stingy about it. Uh, in this town, my villagers gave me everything on the first go. I really hope these don't, like, um, degrade. I don't think they would. But you never know. Do I like any of these shirts? Okay, not really for me. Eh. Eh. You know what? For a change of pace, right? I might sell the other two. Um, and of course my rainbow shirt is a design, so that's why it didn't go back into my pockets. But yeah, maybe what I'll do for tomorrow... Um, well... I was gonna say maybe I won't record tomorrow because Nook's Cranny is gonna be closed, but I still might, to be honest. <laughs> I don't usually do a heck of a lot of selling on camera. It's usually, you know, I'll go fishing and stuff off camera. Alrighty, so we're just gonna get rid of those. Thank you. Alrighty, and let's go check out the Evil Sisters. Maybe they'll have something kind of nice for us. I've been trying to keep an eye out to see if I can't find um, 
the Luigi hat. I'm assuming that's still in this game. Uh, or, you know, just like anything kind of fun. I haven't really found much yet, though. Got the leaf umbrella. Um, I do appreciate you're coming in so often, but I've just got a ton of work to do. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm gonna buy... No. <laughs> I'm not buying that. I'm gonna buy this. E, I will take it. Um, I gotta figure out if I want this hat or not. It doesn't really go with my current shirt, but... Unfortunately, it makes my hair look kind of funny, but I am gonna take it anyway. Actually, I should say, it kind of makes my hair just straight up disappear. <laughs> Hey, so there's that done. Plans for today, though, friends. I was thinking about it uh, yesterday, and I kind of want to start up a little flower spot. I... Right. Right, you don't shovel them in this game. You... You pick them up, don't you? Oh. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm so used to the newer games. Who am I? Uh, I figured we would um, do a little flower breeding spot. I tried to do this in my uh, last stream town and it didn't work out that well because I wasn't signing on every day to water flowers. Um, but I've, I've been on for like the last week, so I may as well give it a try, right? Uh, so... Just gonna try to find what do we have? We have two reds, two white. No, one red, two white, one yellow. Okay, I can do better than that. But yeah, maybe question of the day, because I low-key definitely have forgotten over the last couple of days. What's your favorite flower in the Animal Crossing series? If you've been around my channel for a while, you know it used to be roses. But as of New Horizons, <clears throat> it took me a little bit, but I eventually warmed up. Uh, a lot to the hyacinths. I think they're gorgeous. They're just so pretty. They're kind of like a diluted color. I love the blue and the purple and the pink. Okay, where should I do this, I wonder? You know what? I'm actually gonna use that big, big dirt patch. Because again, I'm pretty sure- I know people have told me all about the, the grass deterioration in this game. But I feel like I can probably maybe get rid of it by watering flowers on it, maybe? Okay, now let me see if I remember my flower combinations. So things will still spawn around there. I also don't know if this game does better with flowers next to each other or diagonally. I know some games it seems to be one way, some games it seems to be another. For now, I'll just do beside each other. So red and red for black, if I'm remembering correctly. Um, and then we got a red and white. Uh, for pink, which is always really pretty. There we go, and we're gonna do a red and yellow. Or, uh, for orange, I think. That's all the colors you can get this way, and if I'm remembering correctly, it is... Is it orange and pink to get purple? Oh, it's been a long time. <laughs> I am misremembering. Uh, I also have an extra red and an extra white, so maybe I'll just plant another... another set here. Um, actually, a bit further away. There we go. I had plans this morning. I was like, yeah, I'll like look up the hybrid guide and um, remember what the colors are, but I... I've forgotten. <laughs> I forgot. Um, and at the very least, doing our hybrid growing this way means I don't have to run around and find all the flowers because they'll all be kind of grouped up. I do wish this game had some sort of, like, 
you know, something to tell you that you've watered them. I like the, the water droplets in New Leaf. Um, the sparkles in New Horizons are also really pretty. And then you, you just get a little bit of watering. There you go. Um, all right, what else should we... What other colors do we... Oh, God. <laughs> what other colors do we got? Uh, so we got these ones. Are these Cosmos or Pansies? These are Cosmos. Okay. I thought they were. And my first gut instinct was telling me they probably were. Uh, but I don't have much faith in myself, so <laughs> I usually don't think I'm correct. Hi, Queenie. I am so, so happy about those fruit. Dear Lord, I am so excited to start like a little orchard somewhere. Um, so red, yellow, white. If I can get myself some more reds here. And again, I'm going to be probably planting the exact same combinations as I did for the roses because I don't actually remember. Um, there we go. If, uh, if there are any different between the species, I'm assuming there's probably some that are a bit different. Um, oh, hi. What's up? Hey, Crystal, I'm not attracting enough attention lately. I think my catchphrase is to be catchier. The world would really take notice then, right? Why is your catchphrase chicken in the first place? You agree? That's great. What do you think my new catchphrase should be? See, here's the thing. I said, why is it chicken? But I have no idea what to make her catchphrase. I always just ask chat whenever I stream, but I'm here by myself right now. <laughs> um, I'm just going to make it queen because I am unoriginal and cannot think of anything on my own. Queen, huh? How do you think that sounds? It's great. So queen, huh? That's pretty fresh. I'll use it. I think it's better than chicken. I will give myself that much credit. It is better than chicken. <laughs> Not that I don't like chickens. Uh, all right. So another, another dig spot right down here. And I think I'm going to go take these flowers and put them... Maybe up here? It's not really like a really dirt covered spot, but it's like starting, as you can see. So we're going to do red and red. I'm going to need an extra red here, I can already tell. Uh, we're going to do a red and a white. No. <laughs> Gosh darn it supposed to go right in front of me. There we go. And then we're going to need a... Yellow. And I need an extra red. I can actually see one already. There we go. Um... And I guess for now, this is probably good. At least get the base colors, you know? Um, we'll work on getting the fancier stuff and whatever when we actually get there, if if we get there. <laughs> it's a lot of work keeping things watered in this game. Um, and I've planted one flower a day pretty much since we started playing. We played about a week ago. Uh, in fact, actually exactly a week ago is when we started this town. Um, but so many more flowers are spawning in and I don't know whether just a set amount spawn per day, or if villagers plant them. So, just water you for good measure. And yeah, look at this. Just look at that. I'm just gonna drop. Oops. <laughs> I'm just gonna drop the remaining flowers we have here. There we go. We're gonna water them. Next Cranny, notice we have decided to expand to better serve you, our loyal customers. You'll be closed for remodeling on February 9th. 
Uh, Valentine's Day is February... Wait, February 14th is Valentine's Day. Maybe you should give that special someone a little present. I heard a rumor. I've been looking up some things about this game, just out of curiosity. Um, and I had heard that apparently if you send a villager a letter with a little gift that says, Will you be my Valentine? Uh, you'll get something back on the 14th. So I'm not sure who I want to send that letter to. But we can give it a try. We can science it. Okay, uh, let's see. How many do we have so far? I think these ones are a little bit different, actually. Um, I'm trying to remember the colors of these ones. I don't think they're the standard. Um, I've never really been a big fan of this type of flower, actually. Fun fact. <laughs> never have. Uh, didn't like the... Oh god, what were they? I think they were violets. There was lilies and violets in New Leaf. And I never ever liked the violets. They always look too much like the lilies, but worse in my very humble opinion. Okay. You know what? Maybe I will look up the hybrid guide really quickly, just so that I don't make a mistake here. Okay, so these are pansies. So I actually wanted to pick up... Oh, I did get two whites. No way I want to pick up an extra white. No, I didn't. Yes, we're good. <laughs> okay. Um... We're gonna do this, and this. This is going to be for, like, a purpley red, apparently. And then if we go down a little bit, we're gonna do a red and yellow for orange. Which I think is pretty standard. I actually picked up the perfect amount. And then a white and white is apparently gonna make, like, a nice little blue one. Which I'm excited for. I love blue. There we go. I don't really expect to get many hybrids uh, anytime soon, mind you. I think the newer games very, very much spoil us with beautiful town ordinances and um, you know, let, in New Horizons, letting your, your friends come over to help water flowers helped out. Um, okay, tulips are next. Let's see. I have so many spare roses hanging out. And again, that's not really me. I'm not planting those. I won't say I haven't planted a couple, but I just plant whatever Tom Nook gives me in the store each day. Oh, there's one. It's funny, like I said, I've been watering them every day, and now that I'm trying to remember where they all are, I have no idea. Hi, Samson. I'll make sure to talk to everyone later. I kind of want to... Oh, no! <laughs> I didn't even see it! Oh! Rude. When I find out who planted that there... Actually, I was just thinking, speaking of things I want to give the villagers, um, that's the other reason why I've been watering them and trying to plant more each day, is I want to give each villager a little flower garden. From what I remember in this game, and from what I've seen as well, the villagers will usually place little flowers around their houses anyway, which I thought was really cute. Um, like, without your input. But they don't really put down a lot, you know? I think I only have two so far. This is off to a great start. Okay. <laughs> Apparently I have an excess of roses. Clearly. Um, and not many tulips. I should probably pick this up while I'm here. pocket space. Okay, so I've actually found all three fossils already today. Uh, go us. 
I have been pretty good about finding them over the last couple of days. Um, and I've been donating, like, he- it, we haven't been getting many duplicates, which is good, but bad for our wallet. <laughs> it's good for the museum, bad for our bell income. Okay, well, I guess I just don't have tulips. Oh, there's another one. Not really one I needed, though. So for tulips, I need red and white. Oh, hello. What's up, buddy? Oh, dear. Is that really your catchphrase? <laughs> Crystal, I was going to give you my modern wall. Oh, thank you. Oh, my goodness. My mom said I should give presents to everyone in town who I'm friends with. They sent me all kinds of cool stuff like the modern wall I just gave you. Thank you. Oh, he's actually been quite a sweetheart. So we need a red and white, red and yellow, red and red, and then yellow and yellow. Apparently can also make black? That seems weird to me. I'll stick with the red and red, maybe. <laughs> if, if I can find any more tulips. I... I don't think we actually have any more. How strange. I thought that we had more of those, but maybe... Oh, well, here's a yellow. I might do these a little bit differently. Um, just have to find a good place for them. Let's put them... Oh, there's another white one. Oh, there goes my pocket. <laughs> uh, because I don't have a lot, Let's just put them right here. And what I was thinking about doing is red is kind of a central one in like three different combinations. So we're going to put that there. And then we're actually going to try diagonal here. I'm going to have a red, a white, excuse me, there we go. Red, white, and yellow. Uh, and I'm actually going to pick this up and move it out of the way. Same with this one. So theoretically, this one will breed with that one. That one will breed with that one. Um, and I know that's not necessarily how it will work out all the time. But at least, you know, while we don't have spare reds, this is better than nothing. Here we go. Alright, well, there's some... some Flowers watered, at least. I'm gonna need to uh, water all the other ones, but why don't we go ahead and head over to the museum? I'm just gonna chuck these down along the way. Um, we can donate our fossils and oh, there's a red. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I'll go plant that later. Um, and then we can uh, go see Brewster, because I don't think we've seen him for a couple days. Actually, you know what? Just look at the time. I'm gonna donate those off stream, or off camera. <laughs> We're just gonna go see Brewster. I just noticed how long I've been recording. Time flies when you're having fun with flowers. Get some coffee will be 200 bells, but it's well worth it. Drink up before it gets cold. Fresh from the pot is the only way. Thank you. It has a smooth flavor and goes down easy. Now that's what coffee's all about. Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty, well I guess that's us set for today. Thank you all so so very much for watching. I'm glad I finally got to do the uh, the flower arranging that I've been kind of itching to do. I was saying I shouldn't do it off camera. I wanted to include you guys in that process. So fingers crossed we get some uh, some pretty hybrids maybe from it or just more flowers in general. 
Um, I may or may not record tomorrow because we're going to have a day without nooks being open, but you know, maybe I will anyway. Um, I hope you have an amazing rest of your day, though, and hopefully I will see you all in the next one.